Greetings, Tracy Tigers, and welcome to this week's edition of Principal Talk. I'm Mr. Bull. And I'm Mrs. Lackey. Welcome back to our second week here in, uh, in this year of 2024. Uh, you all did a great job last week, kind of reacclimating yourself to learning here at Tracy. You've set your goals. You've updated uh, all of the progress that you've been doing and working with your teacher as we are coming to the end of the second quarter. It's hard to believe that we are almost halfway done with the school year. Before we get too far in the news, let's say that Tracy pledged together, I respect you and you respect me. I am responsible so all can see. I choose every day to act kindly. Always a Tracy Tiger, I will be. And as always, we have those Tracy Tiger traits at Tracy. We are respectful, responsible, and kind. Thinking about Tracy Tiger traits and the pledge, we have our January kickoff this week on Monday, so we are excited we'll have a kindergarten through second grade assembly and also a third through fifth. Mrs. Dudenhofer and the Cool to Be Kind team will be sharing all kinds of exciting things for the month of January and also looking into February. So with that, Mrs. Lackey, what do we have? What's new on your side? Well, one event I'm looking forward to, Mr. Bull, is that Chuck E. Cheese night coming up here in yes. January. It's one of the days that we have off from school. I think it's January 19th, but you will get a paper coming coming home and also email to your parents. So that's an exciting one, Chuck E. Cheese night for Tracy School. But on to second step. So our unit is all about managing our emotions. And this week we're going to talk about stop and name your feelings. So it is okay to have strong feelings. But when you feel you have strong feelings, it can be hard to think about what to do. You can get back in control by calming down. And the first step is to use a stop signal to catch yourself and your own attention so that you can tell yourself to stop. You might say to yourself, chill out, or stop, or relax. Next, you want to use your feeling detective skills to name your feeling. When you recognize your feelings, the thinking part of your brain can start to manage them. So take a moment to decide what stop signal you will use this week. I think that's a pretty good skill because all of us have strong feelings from time to time. You've got to come up with a way to stop that sing, sing, stop your brain with a stop signal and then take a minute to name your feeling. For sure, and this will help you better with collaboration, working together in your classrooms, even at uh, recess time or in the lunchroom. Sometimes it's okay to get upset and even get a little bit mad, but we have to stop, think, and name that feeling. I think that's great. Are you ready to wrap it up? Mrs. I am, Mrs. Lackey. Well, you all have a great, great Tiger Day. Bye-bye.